Guys, the main reason why I am making this video on my YouTube channel is to avoid $42,000 fine. And if you don't know what I am talking about and uh, if you are a YouTuber, then please watch this video till the end to avoid $42,000 fine on each individual video on your YouTube channel. Hello guys, I am Vasu and you are watching Technoas. Okay guys, now without any further ado, let's get straight into the video. On September 2019, FTC which stands for Federal Trade Commission fined YouTube $180 million for collecting and storing information about uh, people who are under the age of 13. Now if you convert that $180 million into Indian currency then it's about uh, 1200 crores. So yeah guys YouTube paid 1200 crores fine to FTC. YouTube paid this fine to FTC because YouTube violated the COPPA rule. If you don't know what COPPA is, COPPA stands for Children's Online Privacy Protection Rule. This COPPA rule was introduced in USA in 1998. Under this, digital entities like YouTube are restricted from collecting personal information from users aged under 13 without the express permission of their parents or guardians. So YouTube used to collect data uh, from kids who are under the age of 13 in order to show more uh, relevant and personalized ads. But uh, this was against the COPPA rule. Guys, COPPA not only applies for US, it applies for all the countries around the world. So YouTube in order to comply with COPPA, the YouTube brought out various changes in their algorithm and various changes in their terms and conditions. So guys, all the YouTubers should set their channel made for kids or not made for kids. If they try to cheat the algorithm, then uh, be ready to pay the price. Guys, if you haven't set your channel settings to made for kids or not made for kids content, then log on to your YouTube channel and uh, on the left bottom side, you'll find an option called settings. So click on this option. Now click on the channel option and uh, go to the advanced setting option. Guys, if your channel is made for kids, then uh, select the first option. If your channel is not made for kids, then uh, select the second option. If you upload both kids content and elders content then uh, select the third option. Guys if you select the third option then uh, you should set the preferences whenever you upload a new video. Guys if you are selecting the not made for kids option and uploading all kids content then guys be ready to face the consequences. The maximum civil penalty the FTC may enforce on each individual video is $42,000. Guys, if you mislead multiple videos, take for example, if you mislead 24 videos on your YouTube channel, then multiply 24 into 42,000 dollars. So it's about 1 million dollars. So if you convert this into Indian currency, then it's about 7 crores. So you'll have to pay 7 crore fine. Guys, I won't doubt, okay? I'm not that sure. Uh, guess that uh, I've set my channel to not made for kids content. And if I upload all kids content, I don't know whether FTC will find $42,000 on YouTube or on me, me as an individual creator. So guys, please don't take risk, okay? If you are making kids content, then set your channel as made for kids content. If you are not making kids content, then set your channel as not made for kids content. Don't take risk and, uh, don't take risk and uh, pay $42,000 fine. Guys, if you are confused and uh, don't know whether your channel falls under made for kids content or uh, not made for kids content, then follow these 7 things. What is the subject matter of your video? Whether children are your intended audience for the video? Whether the video includes child actors or models? Whether the video includes characters, celebrities or toys that appeal to children including animated characters or cartoon figures? Whether the language of the video is intended for the children to understand? Whether the video includes activities that appeal to children? Whether the video includes songs, stories or poems that appeal to children? Guys, even after all this, some YouTubers are still confused. Don't worry guys, even YouTube is confused. Take a look. Ultimately, we can't provide legal advice. So we're unable to confirm whether or not your content is made for kids. That decision is up to you taking into consideration these factors. But we want to help you follow the law as much as we can. Check out our help center and talk to a lawyer if you're still unsure whether or not your content should be marked as made for kids. Oh yeah, that's the last thing I want to do. Keep a lawyer. Guys, if you upload a kids video and uh, set that as not made for kids, 
then if copper comes to know that and if youtube can't decide that a particular video is made for kids or not then you will have to settle this in court <laughs> okay guys now let's come to the main part if you upload kids video and set your channel as made for kids content then youtube will take away your majority of your features your comments will be disabled personalized ads will be removed info cards option will be removed end screen option will be removed stories will be removed community tab will be removed notification bell will be removed the ability for a viewer to save and watch them later or save to playlist will be removed all those youtubers who are making kids content will be like i think if you set your channel as made for kids content then according to me at least 60% of the revenue will be decreased the big thing is notification will not be given to the subscribers uh, guess that for example you have a million subscribers on your youtube channel if notifications are removed then hardly you might get 5 to 10000 uh, views on per video guys i know this is a major blow for some of the youtubers who make kids content but even youtube is trying to avoid that uh, 1200 crore fine so guys if you are a youtuber then i'll clear as much as questions as possible so all you have to do is subscribe to my youtube channel and guys if you have any questions regarding this topic then feel free to comment on your question in the comment section okay guys i hope this video has helped you if so then please do drop a like on this video and guys i make all youtube growth related videos tiktok and instagram related videos on this channel so if you are youtuber tiktoker and instagrammer then consider subscribing okay guys if you are a subscriber i'll meet you on the next video until then a peace